it's just a very disappointing time for all of us. Here's a young man that had a 3.95 GPA the first semester, was a preseason All-American, was looking forward to having a big year with us, and now he's on the shelf for a full year. So we've just got to support him, do everything that we can to rehab him. And when you have a surgeon like we have in Steve Jordan and a rehab guy and a trainer like we have in Corey Couture, you feel very comfortable that he will rehab and will return to uh, to form. Definitely a big loss. Um, he's a great guy. You hate when that happens to anybody, especially especially him though. Um, he comes to the field every day wanting to get better and just, you know, just a calm and fun guy to be around. So it hurts us, but we know we're going to have to step up and fill a big role. I think he's taken it uh, as well as any young man can take it after the uh, season that he had last year. And I, obviously after the way that he threw the ball in the fall, he was really developing a changeup that he really worked hard on during the, during the summer and early part of the fall and, and was throwing probably just about as good as any pitcher uh, around here. When you say a, a quality three pitch mix in a long time, uh, his fall numbers uh, showed that. Uh, he obviously didn't distract him in the classroom. He did what he normally does with a 395, I think it was. And but he's uh, he's taking it day by day. You know, he's anxious to kind of get through the procedure and get on the rehab portion of it and uh, hopefully come back stronger next year. Certainly uh, some things that we can do, but obviously there was there was no number two last year other than Mike Compton. So now somebody is pitching against somebody else's number two, which will be an adjustment for him and also us. But we do feel confident with the guys that we're gonna use in those roles. And that's what excites me is we do have some guys that will not be the least bit intimidated when they're given that opportunity. What it does is it creates a void of quality innings. And, and what Michael Compton did a great job with our staff last year was giving us quality starts on a Saturday, uh, pinched in obviously between a Friday and a Sunday, but giving us quality starts on the weekend that allowed our, our bullpen to, to play a shorter role of the game. Uh, that leaves an opportunity for somebody else, uh, somebody to step in, uh, just as he stepped in last year as a true freshman. Because he was really, not that he was an unknown, but it was an unknown who our Saturday guy was going to be last year. So we've got some guys who've been working really hard, not only in the off season, but in the fall and coming on strong now. And, uh, we're anxious just to uh, get started and get rolling.